in the world of modern military technology. The VBCI, Vehicule Blindé de Combat d'Infanterie, stands out as a versatile and capable platform for the French Army. This 8x8-wheeled infantry fighting vehicle, IFV, is designed to transport troops, provide fire support, and operate in high-intensity combat scenarios. Let's dive into the VBCI's history, design features, operational roles, and its impact on modern warfare. The VBCI was developed by Nexter Systems, formerly GIAT Industries, and Renault Trucks Defense, now Arcus, to replace the aging AMX-10P armored personnel carriers. The goal was to create a modern, highly mobile, and well-protected vehicle that could effectively support infantry operations. The first VBCI units entered service with the French Army in 2008. Over 600 vehicles were ordered, with full delivery completed in 2018. The VBCI has since become a key component of the French Army, demonstrating its capabilities in various operational theaters. The VBCI is an 8x8, wheeled vehicle designed for mobility and versatility. Here are some key specifications. Dimensions. Length less than 8 meters, width less than 3 meters, and height less than 2.5 meters. Its overall dimensions, 7.6 x 2.98 x 3 meters allow it to be air transported in an Airbus A400M Atlas or similar transport aircraft. Weight. Empty weight is 19 tons with a payload of up to 13 tons. Speed and range. It has a maximum road speed of 100 kilometers per hour, 62 miles per hour and a range of 750 kilometers, 470 miles under standard conditions. Crew and capacity. The VBCI typically has a crew of three, driver, commander, and gunner. And can accommodate up to eight to nine infantrymen. The VBCI can be equipped with various weapon systems to suit different mission requirements. VCI variant. Typically fitted with a Dragar one-man turret, armed with a 25mm M811 autocannon. And a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun. The 25mm cannon features a rate of fire of 400 rounds per minute and is fully stabilized for accurate fire at range. VPC variant. Fitted with a remote weapon system armed with a 12.7mm M2HB heavy machine gun. Other options. Can be equipped with 20mm RWS, 30mm or 40mm medium-caliber turrets. It can also be armed with systems ranging from RWS 0.5, ARX-20, ARX-25, one-man 25mm turret, 30mm, 40 CTA, to 105mm turret, and anti-tank missiles.
the VBCI is designed to protect its occupants from a variety of threats. Armor. The hull features welded aluminum construction with titanium added to critical regions. It provides all-around protection against 14.5mm armor-piercing heavy machine gun rounds. Modular add-on armor can be fitted to improve the armor level. Spall liners. Internal spall liners add another layer of protection for the crew and its important systems. Mine protection. The cabin floor is designed to offer protection against mines. IED resistance. Designed to resist improvised explosive devices, IEDs, and very powerful mines. Self-defense. The Gallic smoke grenade launcher system improves self-defense. It also has an infrared decoy system. The VBCI is designed to fulfill multiple roles on the modern battlefield. Infantry transport. The VBCI can carry a combat team of up to eight troops, providing them with protected mobility. The troops can rapidly embark or disembark from the power-operated ramp door at the rear of the vehicle. Fire support. The VBCI's autocannon and machine gun provide effective fire support for infantry operations. The 25mm cannon can engage light-armored vehicles, suppress enemy infantry, and even engage low-flying threats like helicopters. Command and Control The VPC, Véhicule de Poste de Commandement, variant serves as a mobile command post, equipped with advanced communication systems. All-weather capability. Standard features include suspension, air conditioning, interior free volume, storage space, NBC warfare protection, and noise and vibration protection. Mobility. The 8x8 chassis with large wheels provides good on-road and off-road mobility. The VBCI can be driven with seven wheels if one is lost to a mine explosion. The VBCI is available in several variants to meet different operational needs. VCI, véhicule de combat de l'infanterie. The standard infantry fighting vehicle version. Equipped with a Dragar turret armed with a 25mm autocannon and a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun. VPC, véhicule de poste de commandement. A command post vehicle fitted with a remote weapon system armed with a 12.7mm machine gun and two SIP stations with seven men plus crew. VTT, Troop Transport Vehicle. An export variant designed to transport troops. It has an interior volume of 13 cubic meters and can carry a two-man crew and up to 10 soldiers with their equipment. VBCI 32T. The 32T variant has been developed to increase protection against improvised explosive devices and possesses a centralized tire inflation system and a reinforced undercarriage. VBCI 2. An improved version intended for export. With a new 600 horsepower Volvo D13 turbocharged diesel engine. New air conditioner and new optronic sensors. It is heavier, 32 tons, and equipped with a two-man turret integrating the CTA 40 CT 40 mm auto cannon. The VBCI has seen extensive use with the French Army in various conflict zones, including Afghanistan, 
Lebanon, and Mali. Its performance in these operations has underscored its reliability, mobility, and effectiveness in diverse and challenging environments. The VBCI has proven its worth as a modern and capable IFV. With ongoing development and upgrades, such as the VBCI-2, it is expected to remain a key component of the French Army and attract interest from export customers. Its modular design and upgradability ensure that the VBCI can adapt to evolving threats and continue to provide effective fire support and protected mobility for infantry forces. The VBCI represents a significant advancement in armored vehicle technology offering a balance of firepower, protection, and mobility. Its versatility makes it a valuable asset for a wide range of missions, from high-intensity combat operations to peacekeeping duties. As the French Army and other nations look to modernize their armed forces, the VBCI is likely to remain at the forefront of infantry fighting vehicle design for years to come. For more military technology insights, remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Until next time, this is Truman, signing off. Stay informed, and stay safe.